Good morning, Saints. Welcome to Saints at 8. Today is Wednesday, January 11th, and we are broadcasting live from our National Park of the Week, the Huangi National Park in Zimbabwe, Africa. Founded in 1928, it is the largest national park in Zimbabwe, and it is estimated to be to the home for about 40, 44,000 elephants. That's a lot of elephants. And now it's time for the Pledge of Allegiance. Please stand up in your classrooms and place your right hand over your heart. Are you ready, Saints? Let's begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Blue basketball team played Tampa Day School yesterday evening and recorded their seventh win of the season. The whole team worked very hard, both offensively and defensively, to pull off the 35-9 victory. Fantastic job, Saints. Good luck in your next game on Tuesday, January 17th versus Corbett Prep. The girls' basketball team traveled to Academy at the Lakes and ended their dry spell with a thrilling victory. The Saints started really strong first quarter, scoring eight points and continued the streak, adding six, four, and two points in the second, third, and fourth quarters, respectively. Ella contributed 12 points on the board, while Catalina and Sam each added four points. The Saints also played tough defense, keeping their opponents to only 10 points all game. The final score was 22 to 10. Great job, ladies, and congrats on your win. The JV boys basketball team traveled to Academy at the Lakes on a f for a f first time matchup this season. Henry put up the first four points for the Saints in the first quarter. Second quarter, Jake stepped onto the court and also added four points to give the Saints an eight to two lead. Going into the second half on the game, AATL did not give up as they scored four points in the third quarter, closing the gap to just two points. Mark was fouled in the, and sank one of his two free throws to make the game-winning shot, giving the Saints a 9-8 win over the Wildcats. Awesome game, boys, and congrats on the victory. For after-school sports and activities, the girls' gold basketball team and boys' gold basketball team both host games against Tampa Prep today. The girls' soccer team hosts a game against our crosstown rival, St. John's on our own field this afternoon. All these teams would love to have your support as they battle at home today. Good luck to all of our Saints. And now it's time for everybody to head over to Chapel. We hope you all have an amazing day and go Saints! <laughs>